Hello everyone, Excedra here bringing you episode 12 of Desertopolis, a mod pack by Beben Law. Well, in the last episode, worked on moving a lot of things downstairs. I started making some more crystallized mineral from mineral trees because I was kind of waiting on the chicken. And as you can see, we should now have a... Oh no, we're not a tent at... I didn't finish! Well... Let's just make a little bit more right now. And there's nothing in the chest. Probably because the this is recharging. Yeah, perfect. Okay, let's just go back there. Now I have a couple of seeds. Uh, I'm still apparently working on ten ten tending my chickens. That is kind of sad. Oh, I hope you didn't mix with the wrong one. Okay, so we have a ten eight. 7, 10, 8, 7, 10, 6, 5, you go away. And for the string, we have a 10, 9, 9. You are the weakest link. Gotta go. And let's just try to accelerate. What's the uh, reading cooldown? 65 second. Can I bring you down to 65 second too? And what's you? 63 second. Let's just give it everything that I have left. We're going to Go oh, and process these into chicken, uh, into uh, cooked chicken. And let's just go back here, do this again, and do this again. I'm just like force harvesting a little bit because I want to get to uh, the seeds. Like I want to get the seeds right now. And by the way, I don't know if I showed you that last episode, but you can feed any kind of seeds to these chicken. So now I just have these this barrel with all of the seeds in it. And they just go into the chicken. And as you can see, there's no more resource anywhere in there because it's being imported from under into my system downstairs. We'll go there in a second. Ooh, ouch. Let me just see six seconds. We can wait. Then we're going to go sleep. Then we're going to go see what we've done downstairs. And then we're going to start working toward our nutrient collectors. 10-9-9. Come on. Give me a 10-10-10. Please, 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 please. You are the weakest link for sure. What? Ah, oh, 10, 9, 10. Well. Uh, one. I'm going to give a couple of whack to this one too. This is a bit of a waste of seed, but it's just because I don't want to wait. And give me a black chicken. This one's going to be 10, 8. Ten eight. Oh, they're both the same. So goodbye to you. And what are you? Ten nine nine. Okay. So I kind of forgot to continue, but they're on, well, on their way. So let's come over here. And since we're chickening things, let's let's do the other chicken, the important chicken. So if I come here, I made a couple more ten 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 chicken. And you know what? Come on, give me a baby. And give me another baby. Perfect. So all of those are good. We're going to put a couple of those here and time to make our 10, 10, 10 obsidian chicken. In the last episode, I did concentrate on getting lots of obsidian. Whoa. And okay, obsidian is going to be a bit painful. I have to be very careful to just feed the chicken, not put one on the ground or else I won't be able to pick it up. So please don't move, Mr. Chicken. So this is going to be the best way of handling Obsidian. The first 250 were hard, but now that we have 250, we can eat uh, 260, I think. I don't remember. I think it's 250 something. Let's just continue that. We're going to get our first obsidian chicken. That we're going to be able to start producing obsidian from in a way easier form. And I got it up to 600, which is not bad, but I think I might make two obsidian chicken just so I can make babies. <gasps> Stop moving. You don't want to put an obsidian block on the ground by mistake. Because I don't think I have... Oh yeah, I have a diamond pickaxe. I'd be able to pick it up, but it would just be annoying. That's going to be my fourth stack of obsidian. And voila! 10, 10, 10 obsidian chicken! That's really what I wanted right now. Uh, Do I have a... 
and then we'll capture net. Yeah, let's grab you and we'll put you. Ooh. So these are not connected. I still have to move these downstairs, unfortunately. Do I have a drawer? No, I have. I need a two by two drawers. I'm going to need this. I'm going to need a. Let's make a two by two drawer. Nope, not the fluid grid. So, drawer. You know what? Hey, I'm out of power. What the heck happened? I guess I stopped the reactor, or maybe the reactor stops every time. Anyway, we're back up. It's because it's night and this is not working, and we're using a lot of power downstairs now. Okay, so let's make a, a drawer pattern for this one right here. And let's put that in one of our multi crafter. It's so sad that we can't make more. Uh, by make more, I mean like not have the ability to uh, to make them. Like there's a. I'm trying to remember. Give me a moment. There's a mod that lets you make like crafters that are way way better. And we're going to want a. Is it called? A stasis chicken stasis chamber. Stasis. Oh, let's search here. Stasis. Oh my god, missed click. Let's grab this. And then we're going to be able to come right over here. And we're also going to remove that. Perfect. I'm going to put this right here. The reason I needed to move this out of the way a little bit is I want to be able to click it with my wrench. Right. Oh, right here. Extract. I need another, sorry, one second. So I need to put one right here and then we can set this to extract. Great. And then I can close this back with a white one. White colored stone, put this on top and put the obsidian chicken in and feed it every kind of seed possible. We're gonna go. Oh, maybe we can't use a tomato seeds. Oh, well. If we can't use the tomato seeds, just take those out. Take those and come back over here and feed them. So I do still need to move the chicken downstairs and I'm going to move them downstairs when I'm going to start like massively uh, like increasing the chicken. I might end up having two or three of obsidian chicken, two or three of a couple of type of different chickens. Okay, so now that we have that, let me put back the obsidian for now because I don't really need it. Well, I'm going to need it, but I don't need it immediately. Let's sleep. Let's go take care of our chicken uh, again. And then let's go back. Let's go downstairs to start working on the stuff for today's episode. Okay, so that should now be a 10, 10, 10. Come on. Yes, 10, 10, 10. So next one I grow should automatically be a 10, 10, 10. Should be the same thing for these. So 10, 9, 9, 10, 9, 10, you are the weakest link and you're finally 10, 10, 10. Okay. So when I come back to these, I should get 10, 10, 10 for both of them and be able to breed them as many times as I need. So goodbye. Goodbye. Let's go downstairs to show you what I've been doing. So, uh, this was already there. This was already there, but we connected it to an alloy smelter and I moved And I move this production here downstairs so that the blackstone, we produce blackstone that comes in here that makes gilded blackstone that goes into this drawer that becomes uh, gold nuggets. Gold nuggets come into block. And right here, all I did was put an advanced pipe upgrade with a gold ingot. So that only export gold ingot. And in here, <clears throat> the moment we get our fourth gold ingot, it melts and we get netherite and we have 897 netherite. Right here, I made kind of a temp setup where I'm just always uh, making, uh, what's, what is it again? It's uh, grains of infinity. So it's not a high percentage chance. It's not one every time. It's a 5% chance. I put a, some dark steel grinding ball for now, and I'm just trying to get as many as I can because we need that for processors. So uh, not processor, what are they called? So grain... 
Okay, let me just find it because now I have a blank. So if I take a grain of infinity, it's to make these capacitor. Capacitor. Yeah, so now technically I should be able to say give me one of those. It's saying we need all of this. Start and it should auto craft it. Okay, this is all great. Let me just take a quick look here at my battery. And the moment this is fully charged, I should probably start stopping this uh, machine, not to burn through all of my stuff. What are you? Oh, an R vest. Do finally. Yeah, I don't know what was going on. It seemed to be stuck in here. Okay, let's take a small short break to recenter and figure out what we were doing. Oh, that's why I stopped the Blackstone because I still had some on me. I don't care. I'm gonna I'm gonna get rid of it some other way. Let's go and do a little bit of ten 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 chicken, and then we're going to complete. Uh, start really working on making those neutron collector. 1099 this is a second 10 10 10 which is perfect and you and you should give me a second 10 10 10 chicken hey got 10 10 10 all the way so if you guys remember the reason for the string chicken was that we need to make a lot of processors and processors need binders and binders need chickens so if i come right here and i search for processor like you remember if i want to craft this it needs so this is crafted from a raw advance and the raw advance is from a processor binding and processor binding is two string and a slime ball so i wanted to make sure that i was going to be able to auto craft this as much as i need whenever i need which is why the string chicken um it's great so you know what let's also do i have another stasis chamber i'm also going to put this down stasis nope Basis, make one, and let's look for seeds. Let's grab these seeds, and we're going to need that second drawer that I made. Voila. Let's go back here. I'm going to put down that chicken right now because, like I said, I need it to produce stuff as soon as, as fast as possible. No. Let's go back up. <laughs> okay so right here we're going to put you and then we're going to put you we're going to need the wrench to put you in extract mode i don't know if i got it let's just oh no it's not an extract mode for sure now it's an extract mode come on there's no place in the system for the netherite oh yeah, let's just come over here, put you, and let's go grab one of our chicken. Uh, I don't care about the black dye chicken. All I really care about, honestly, is the string chicken. So, boom, boom, make another baby chicken. Come here, and you're going to be installed and start producing some string. And let's give all of this to you. And then let's close this. Nope, this time it's a black block this and we should be good so this one how oh, it started producing but it hasn't extracted probably because i have no place to put an obsidian so let's go downstairs and let's look at our wall and is there a spot somewhere for obsidian yeah right here and i don't know why i should have netherite scrap oh it's full okay so at least i have a spot there uh, can I get rid of everything? Let's do this. Yeah, got rid of most of everything. Perfect. And now let's just put some things in here. This and not playing with chicken for a little while now. Okay. So we had started all of this automation with patterns. That's how we were able to make our capacitor. We cooked all of the metals that we needed and i still need to split those across multiple alloy smelters so that they all work at the same time we have the inscriber we have the pattern all of this is good this is where we're we were making lava that's how i was forcing my lava production for upstairs so let's go upstairs let's look at what we need to craft for the uh 
Uh, where's my ultimate crafting table? Wait, ultimate? I, I need to craft another one? Okay. With auto crafting, I should be good. And it seemed that nothing was missing. While we're here, uh, crafting grid. Crafting grid. No, that's a crafting grid. Crafter grid. Uh, no, redstone, normal, descending, quantity, normal. Okay, so it's not here. I thought there was a way of being able to, to see what we were crafting. Oh, Arliss crafting grid. Why have I not made this yet? Okay, let's make another crafting grid. Make another. Okay, so I'm going to try something. <clears throat> Control, shift, plus. Don't know if that's going to work. Let's try it again. Grid. Control, shift. Oh. So it did work. Okay. Let me explain to you again. I'll do it with the next one. So now I need the actual crafting grid. So I want to craft this, but do you see how the plus is blue? I never noticed that before. It means that if I control click, I can request with a crafting of a crafting table. I do that like this. The problem is I forgot to clear my grid first, and this does not work if you do not uh, clear your grid, but it requests the crafting of everything that you need to make your, um, <laughs> to make your, uh, the sub items that you need. So at refined wireless so we're going to need a wireless and transmitter right here oh, and i i missed doing it. so let's take all of this out let's go right here on the wireless transmitter and i'm going to control click this so it should make me i i so i thought that what it was going to do was fill this so it's making the missing part but it's not finishing the crafting but when i come back now at least it's done so now that we have that, this, and that's 16 block only, uh, we're going to need to recharge that. No network not found. Let's just out of energy. So I need to recharge it. I thought I was going to be able to put it in one of the battery. Nope. Doesn't fit in here doesn't fit in here hmm okay let's see if we have a charger oh yes we do <laughs> uh i think it's this right here put it in here or not how am i going to charge charger no search here charger oh the wired charger this the, like this should have worked i believe this is the extended charger oh what is what is it going to do if i press g old g up oh. i must have pressed something that reloaded that's very weird but where's the extended charger? Advanced charger can charge four items at the same time. No, okay, so that's not what I want. Uh, doesn't seem to want to charge this, so maybe a wired charger like this. Okay, so wired charger. And I control, so none of these are automated. I'm going to need to automate copper ingot. So if I come here and I say copper alloy ingot like this, uh, processing, perfect. Let's go downstairs and it should be in this one. So copper ingot, we're going to be able to require eight. So copper ingot, let's make eight of those. 
Perfect. So that should be crafting. Once that is crafted, if we come back to I need a void chassis, I should probably, you know what? I'm going to create a pattern for that. So this is not a processing pattern. Let's come right here and say this is for void chassis. I should absolutely, I should also have a recipe for bars. You want to make sure that it's not already somewhere. Perfect. So put those two right there. So now we should be able to order a wired charger, which I can come right over here. Don't know if that's going to be, I need a capacitor. I don't want the higher level capacitor in there. So I'm just going to take a basic capacitor for now uh, because I don't want to store all my energy in this machine. The higher the capacitor you put, the more energy goes into the machine. So this is not extracting power. We're going to go like this and put you one away. Or you know what? No, that's the thumb. Put you right here. And yeah, you're getting power. So now I can take this and get power. I've got to start charging my leggings. So let's put my leggings in here. And I'll come back in a moment. Oh, I'm so slow now. <laughs> and come back here. My grid is going to be fully charged in a moment. Hey, hey, and it's crafting. Oh, I'm so happy. I should have done that way before. I don't know why I completely forgot that that was a thing. It is absolutely completely a thing. So let's come back over here and let's search an app refined. I want to make it uh, go further. So range upgrade. Come on, um, upgrade. Doesn't seem to have worked. I need some glass. We don't have any glass. Wow. That is the dumbest thing ever because glass is just cooked sand. Let's come over here and I can't put that through the alloy smelter. Anyway, let's go upstairs. I'm going to need a different furnace for the time being. We're going to do glass the good old way. Like this. And I don't remember why I made smooth stone. Hopefully that's going to come back to me. For now, let's just wait for a little bit of glass. One and two. Oh, I'm so slow. And like this is going to give us a upgrade. And then I can do a range upgrade. Perfect. And the range upgrade can be crafted. Nope. So there's not, there's nothing like more higher. Oh, we really are missing one interesting mod. So now we can go to 24 block. Eh, that seems to cover all my base. Might not downstairs though. So let's just go downstairs and try something. If I go down here. Nope. It goes up to here. So another range upgrade and my whole base should be covered. And you know what? I'm going to call this one good enough for now. So let's just go upstairs and now finally start the thing that I've been talking about. Before we do that, though, sleep and let's check one last thing. Okay, I want to see something here about fluid. Fluid tank. Do I have a fluid tank? I really need to try this. Do I have a fluid tank? I have a small fluid tank. Can I put that down right here? Let's say. I want to try something, okay? So this is a empty crafter. So I'm going to grab an empty crafter because I've been doing some research on Discord and someone said that there might be a way of automating the fluid with like a processing pattern and a bucket. So let's say that I put myself in uh, processing mode. Okay. And then I should be able to grab some lava.
normal stretch. How do I change to fluid? Hmm. Oh, nope, that's not what I want. Okay, so I can't seem to figure this out right now because technically the idea is to be able to tell it how to make a lava bucket, but I need to be able to tell it to make lava. Let me go downstairs. I so the idea was to do something like this, okay? Put a crafter right here, and then you need to tell it to send a bucket to this. And if I go like this and I get a bucket, and I go to the fluid grid and I grab a bucket and I do this. So technically, if I put a bucket in here, I'm going to create a lava bucket. But what I need now is to be able to tell it to give me lava. Oh, okay. So if I say lava right here and here, I click out of fluid and I do this. So I say if I export one bucket of lava and one bucket, it's going to give me a lava bucket. If I come right here and I put this pattern in here and I put some cables, of course, I'm really not sure if this is going to work. It's not something that I've tested before. This, and if I come here and I say lava, and I say craft, I'm missing something now. Just give me a second. Importer, I need an importer for sure. So let me craft a quick importer. This and importer on here. So it did not receive the bucket. Hmm. So here it's missing the bucket like this. And if I come back in here and I say lava, I have, how do I have two buckets of lava then? Wait a moment. Okay. Let's take back those two. Let's push those in here. And let's say that I want four buckets of lava. Uh, okay. And I say lava here. Oh. It does work. Oh. oh, do you think I'm happy? Oh, yes, I'm happy. Oh, okay. So let's grab some bucket, some more right here. Let's do this and let's go right here and grab a. Oh, who knew? Okay. So the water is that it's all being exported here. So right now. I'm going to disconnect you because technically I don't need this obsidian maker anymore and do this, which is going to make me run faster now. Thank you. Okay. So let's come back here. Let's wait for the bucket of water. Perfect. Let's come to this pattern and let's say, let's put ourselves in fluid mode, bucket of water. Let's remove the fluid mode and let's say bucket of water and create the pattern the pattern right there. Let's see if I go here and I ask for water now. Can I ask for, let me check that I have, I do have, let's wait for two. I find it more convincing if I can make two at a time. Two, so water, two buckets, start. One and two. <laughs> hey, we fixed that problem, which means if I come here now, uh, let's make 30 patterns. Nope, need glass, need a lot of glass. That's where all of my glass is going. So I need to figure out the cooking. Well, I'm bullshit. I'm full of bullshit. 
I have a fix for the, the glass. I just guess I'm a bit tired or something. So let's just come back over here. And now uh, I'm going to need some. Oh, the, the pattern. That's what I was doing. Pattern. Give me 32. Start. Go. 32 pattern. Perfect. Let's come over here. And now resource generator. Oh, right here. You are now craftable. I can put you in here. And if I come back here and I say resource gen, I want four of you. I already have three, three, perfect start. Oh, victory. Oh, I don't know what happened here. This is kind of bizarre. No, I'm not running out of buckets. I do have enough buckets. Why didn't it send a bucket in here? Might be a problem with this. Let's do, let's do one more. Start. You craft one, available one, available one, available one. Start. And it did it. I'm going to have to keep an eye on it, but we now are able to craft resource generator, which is going to make everything so much easier. Oh, perfect. So now let's get started. We need diamond lattice. We're finally in the episode now. We need diamond lattice, lattices, and we need crystal matrix ingot. Wow, these look great. <laughs> so now the ultimate crafting table. If I come back here and I say ultimate, when I grab this ultimate, uh, I want to make into an ultimate Odo. So I'm going to need some hoppers. Hoppers. I need 10 more. I don't need 10, but like with this, I'm going to be good. Let's do this. Let's go around like this and put the ultimate crafting table like this. Perfect. So unfortunately, the Odo crafting table doesn't work. Like I, maybe it works in this pack. I don't think it does, but let's just try something. If I go, let's grab a hopper and a barrel. So one hopper, grab two barrel, two hopper, barrel. Nope, I need to craft barrel. No point, like I could make an auto crafting recipe for this, but I don't really see the point. Blank this and this perfect so barrel so what i'm going to do is i'm going to set a barrel right here i'm going to set a hopper right there the auto crafting table on top and i'm going to need another crafter is it something that i'm auto crafting yes give me one crafter and I don't think it's going to work, but I'm going to try it anyway, because every mod pack have different flavors. So sometimes something that doesn't work in another pack might work in this one. I'm, to be honest, I am really not super hopeful, but uh, it is worth taking a moment to try it. So let's do this. And now let's come over here and make a pattern for diamond lattice. maybe let's make this pattern and now i'm going to need a pattern for the diamond mesh and then i'm going to need the pattern for the and steel bars perfect so in here in here i'm going to put these two patterns and in here i'm going to put this pattern and let's try it once so if i say lattice I say, make one of these. Oh, this is going to need power, is it? Completely forgot about that part. So let's just do a quick job like this, which is not super clean, but for now, I just want to know if it's the power that's the problem. This. And if we come back here and we search for diamond. So my mesh are not here. I don't know if the crafting is, is like stuck somewhere. Okay. 
So we're going to come back here. I'm going to break you. And you. And I'm going to try potentially another way. So hopper like this. Crafter to hopper like this. No, oh, wrong wrench. This wrench. And put this pattern here. Let's try that again. At this. Hmm. This is not. How is this energetic photovoltaic thing not making any energy? Oh, this is bizarre. Yo, how are you not producing energy? Are these not all producing energy? Anyway, let, let's try something different. Okay, let's come back and say diamond. Uh, how many do we need? We need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so give me eight of you. And we're going to wait for all eight. Perfect. And then we're going to need the and steel thing. Let's make another craft of that. Perfect. So we got those. Let's come back over here and let's try something different. So we're going to go recipe like this. We're going to say lattice. And we're going to shift click this in. Perfect. And shift left click to say shift left click. Perfect. And then it's selected. And now it's just, oh, we're now receiving power. For somewhat reason, we are now receiving power. And come on. How much? Oh, it's going. Oh, so it's trying to. You know what? Let's shift right click for now. We're going to need to wait for this to fill. Perfect. So if it fills, that should probably be better. And if I come here and I look at this, let's make another barrel. I want to try something. So plank. Give me a couple of planks and let's make another barrel. I'm going to try one last way. Let's break this. Put a barrel on top here. Let's put the crafter toward the barrel this time. Perfect. Let's put cable right here. Now, if this doesn't work, I'm going to be really shocked. It's it's disgusting, but let's try it. So if I come back here and I say lattice and I say I want one of those start, it's going to make eight. It's going to make 17. They should really go in here. They do. And now they go in the item hopper, which goes into the right position. Now, the problem is that we're not going to have enough energy. So does it say how much energy is required to craft this? Oh, it's going. Okay, so this really needs a lot of power. We're going to have to bring it downstairs and connect it, but we seem to have been able to automate this part. Ish. Come on. Come on. And now they should exit to here and here. So now they just need to be imported. So let's make another importer. This. And this, voila. So if I put the importer right here, and again, put a cable to connect this. Hey, let's throw all of this in. It needs to be imported anyway. I feel super amazing with that. Okay, so now we've got the diamond lattice automated. We need to automate the crystal matrix. So this is a bit more problematic because we need vibrant crystal and pulsating crystal. So processing pattern, let's search for crystal let's search for crystal right here um pulsating crystal oh okay that's just a crafting recipe 
that should be good and the vibrant crystal is also just a crafting recipe <coughs> put those in here and let's see if we can make some <coughs> okay i want how many do we need we need one two three four five six seven eight nine ten so let's ask for ten it's missing vibrant alloy so that's not true let's grab some vibrant alloy I'm gonna grab this and the other ones are what the other one are pulsating well those are only nuggets doesn't matter let's go downstairs and uh, there's not a single drawer oh i've got one compacting drawer right here but we're going to need our key to make sure that it doesn't get put and accessible do this Let's grab these and say. Please. <laughs> this is the kind of things that's really frustrating. and lock perfect that just took seventy-eight thousand tries why is this not oh we're out of mesh okay good to know i'll have to put a new mesh in here i could probably set auto export of mesh but that's going to be for later so let's put you right here now i need another compacting drawer compacting nope oh darn it can I say compacting drawer like this and will the control click work? Oh, yes, I have one. Perfect. Well, let's go downstairs and let's put that one right here. Now take the key off to not make the same stupid mistake. Put those in. Voila, great. Now we can go back up and we should be able to make these now. So crystal, again, how much do we want? One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, six, seven. Ten and seven. So ten of these. Um Are you really going to make me do that? Oh, that is so annoying. Okay, so it doesn't know how to make the nuggets. So this is very disgusting, but I have to do this because now. If I say crystal, here's what it's going to say. It's going to say, I'm missing some crystal. So to make the missing crystal, I'm going to do all of this. So we're losing one crafting recipe to do this, but it's not like we have a choice. And here we're going to say, make seven of these, which is going to, oh, it's going to be the same issue. It's just going to uh, appear as a problem later because right now we don't, like we didn't need any. I still need to make this. And so now a crystal matrix ingot means one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, no, 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 no. Let's come over here and let's just teach it to do this. The eight. And now we're going to throw all of these in here. We're going to put that pattern right there. It's not going to know how to do it because the machine's not automated for it. But if I ask for crystal, crystal matrix ingot and i say make one of these i'm missing 35 pulsating alloy and apparently i've not taught my system how to make pulsating alloy let's come right here and teach it how to make this and this is processing so good let's go down here and put this in the processing the right place if i come back here I'm not quite sure about one thing though. Like I do have my seven pulsating crystal here. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Uh, no. I have my seven. I only have four of the vibrant one though. So if I say start, see, I don't understand why it wants to make more. Oh. Wait, 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 wait. So I need vibrant alloy. 
and I need three vibrant alloy. And I think the vibrant alloy is made from pulsating alloy. And now we're missing ender pearl. Oh, oh yes, true. Okay, so we now need an ender pearl recipe. If I come here for ender pearl, there is an ender pearl recipe like this right here. But then it means we need a fused alloy recipe like this, which means we should be good now ish. Oh, wow. Yeah, this is full. But let's come up here and let's ask for ender pearl. Can I ask to craft 10? Crafting ingredient ended up needing itself. You need to remove the pattern or make sure the pattern is not used during crafting. Oh. Hmm. It needs to use itself. That is not ideal. Give me a second to think about this. Uh, first off, is there an <clears throat> a chicken for this? Ender, Enderium chicken, Enderman chicken. Diamond and Nether wart. Why not have an Enderman chicken then? Oh, I'm going to go sleep. I don't like the enemies around. <clears throat> okay, so let's just... Let's back up a second. So, Ender Pearl. We make Ender Pearl. We need fused alloy. So, if I come here and I say fused alloy, and I grab these three, and I say, can you make 20 of those? <clears throat> yes, I can. Go. And if I grab the ender pearl nuggets and or pearl i grab these and i transform this into nine more let's go downstairs so i'm just going to auto feed that to the machine so that we start making ender pearl i'm gonna grab one and go like this i'm gonna have to figure out how to automate this one i'm not quite sure right now but we're gonna need to figure it out for sure for now, let's just make a ton of ender pearl so that we don't have that problem. And we could probably make a 10, 10, 10 ender pearl chicken. If I come here, enderman chicken, uh, quantity 250 ender pearl. Yeah, we can probably do that. So if I come back here to ender pearl, we need what's called the fused alloy. Fused alloy. 60. Start. Ender pearl. Okay, I know why it's not working. It's not working because we have this left in here. But as soon as we fix that, we should be good. Do all of these. Oh, that's a lot. Wow. And let's come here for the fused alloy. Going to wait for the 60. And we're going to have to figure out a way of automating the ender pearl true. Maybe a processing recipe? Maybe like just, oh no, it is a processing recipe already. I was going to say, maybe we can find a way of tricking it or gimmicking it or something. I, I, I don't think I'll be able to, unfortunately. I'm going to have to just rack my brain about that at some point. So I'm going to make an ender, uh, ender chicken once uh, I have 256 ender pearl because I want it to be 10, 10, 10. I don't want to go through the whole growing pain process. So when I can make one, an enderium... And also make an Enderium chicken. What are the chickens that are available again? If I come over here. Those are color. Okay, so there's not. I, I was. The reason I was looking is I was wondering if we could not get like a vibrant alloy chicken or something like that. That would have been cool. But no. So no problem. Let's just go with that for now. And let's come back up here. Which means, uh, can we now request a crystal matrix? Start and start. And it should all come in here once it's crafted. And then we'll need to set the second recipe. 
like this. I'm going to need the ingredients. I don't know what it's doing right now. Should probably have done this in part. Let's just come over here. Okay, this is crafting. So as long as there's crafting happening here, I'm going to wait because it's probably going to be good at some point. And I'm just going to come over here and put everything I can here. Nope. Is there not a spot for the ender pearls? I guess not. So if I come back here and I say crafting, oh, no, I'm going to ask for a compacting drawer. Sorry. Give me another compacting drawer and I put you there and I do this. Yeah, so this works. We're going to lock this drawer. I'm going to pick it up and we're going to go and put it downstairs. Like this, right here. Not a good spot, but whatever. It's in there now. If I come here, is this completed? No, so it must still be crafting. Let's go downstairs. This is no longer crafting. Oh, this is kind of annoying. Did I lose all my material? Did this pattern not work? You are annoying the heck out of me. That's the problem. There's no crafting interface, so I don't know what's been crafted or what's not been crafted. Full matrix. Just ask for crystal. I don't know what you've done and I hate you. So diamond lattices. Let's grab four. One, two, three, four. And then what else do we need? We need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, 14 and steel. Give me 14 and steel. Come on, boy. Give me my 14 and steel. I am really unhappy with you. You stole 14 and steel, 4 diamond lattice, 10 vibrant crystal. Wait, four. What did you do? Seven pulsating. Okay. I don't understand what went on there. That was super weird. It was asking for 49. Anyway, so now we need our end steel. That's our 14 end steel. Uh, we also need one, two, three, seven pulsating crystal. But we need seven of you. Go. And then we're going to need 12 of you. But again, we're going to wait one part at a time. Seven of you. Twelve of you. This one's a two-step process, if I remember. It needs to cook two levels of alloys. Yeah. See, now it's making the, the signalum, uh, the energetic one, and then the energetic into vibrant, and then we should be good. Oh, just sad that I lost so much material. I need to be careful with my recipes. So if I come here and I say now that I want to make this, I can now shift click to save this recipe and grab this from here. Crystal matrix ingot and we've got eight. Perfect. So now this is one of the problems that I'm going to have. One of the problems that I'm going to have is that I'm going to need two machines because I need to make these at different times. So if I look at latest, latest, I still have eight. Okay. So let's come back here and I'm going to switch you to recipe two. And I'm going to ask for another crystal matrix ingot. So crystal, grab these eight. Please don't, you better work. If you don't work, I'm going to be so. Don't lose me my material. Start making it and bring it in here. Let's go downstairs. And this is doing its thing. So 
as long as this machine is doing stuff, I still have hope for the rest. But if I lost all of these material again, I'm going to be so unhappy. Which means we should be able to get our first nutrient collector. Block of quartz enriched iron. Oof, that's expensive. Okay. Uh, do I have quartz enriched iron? I should have a chicken doing that. Graphite bar. No, I don't think I have a quartz enriched iron chicken. And is it a thing? Quartz enriched chicken. It is a thing. And it can be made with uh, 250 quartz enriched Let's just come over here and what's going on with my needs? How is this not making any stuff? Is it still stuck in here? Oh, maybe they need to recharge because I had my armor in there. Oh, that's going to be annoying if that's the case. <clears throat> Let's come over here and get rid of the stuff that we do not need. Perfect. And then let's see which one are not fed properly here. These are all a bit low. That's okay for now. I don't really care. The netherite chicken is honestly probably the most useless chicken that I've made. Let's put that right here and I'm going to need to make a quartz enriched chicken. <clears throat> quartz. Oh, I have a lot of quartz enriched iron, so I can do this. Okay, so let's try for the neutron collector then. Neutron collector, like this. Um, yeah, I need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so let's grab my quartz enriched. And grab all of this. And now let's make a compacting drawer again. Everything that needs to be compacted, like needs to be in block form, I'm going to get from the, um, I'm going to get into a compacting drawer. It's just the easiest way of doing it. So like this and like this, and let's put that perfect, which means we now have all of the compacting iron that we need, which means we can put you here. I come back here and I search for quartz. Yeah, so they are done properly. Oh, let's go see what's happening with this here. Did it make one? No, it didn't. I lost all of my material again. Are you kidding me? You know what? I think... No, it is a processing. I don't understand why it's not going in here. I'm concerned. Crystal. Oh, so I have six vibrant crystal here. Give me seven. I'm going to try it one last time. I'm getting a bit worried now because I'm losing so much material. But give me seven of these. Perfect. Then this requires one, two, three, four, five, ten. So I need four more of these. Wait for the four so that we get the ten. Then we're going to need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So fourteen and four crystal matrix. Uh, lit lattice. I have the four. Oh, um, where's my vibrant crystals at? Crystal. See, did these vibrant crystal get eaten or what? Like, where are they? Now, I'm curious about something else. Let me come over here. This is the fluid disk. This is... No, there's still a lot of space. Okay. So what I was wondering is that maybe I didn't have enough space to bring it into my system. 
me just sleep and then we'll check but i don't understand why these crystals are not being made oh and i've been missing on the amazon tablet offer every day let me just check quickly uh is there anything i could be selling some beet but that's not even worth it anything else nope nothing that's interesting so let's put that back in here come back here show that in here and let's say crystal okay so i have three now i don't know what it was doing and i don't know where the fourth one is I'm not waiting for this Where's the fourth one? This is so... Oh! Eight. I don't know what's going on. Something. So at least it's producing it. So I don't have to be concerned anymore. But that was super bizarre. Okay. So let's just concentrate on the Neutron Collector then. Neutron Collector. Because that's what I want to make for this episode. So we're going to need one, two... Let's just do uh, 30 and steel i'm going to make it by hand because i'm not taking a chance i'm gonna need 32 and steel go and then how many i'm going to need one two four six eight of those processors so processors Ooh, i've got enough so let me take eight right here let me grab eight from here perfect what else do i need i need one two three four five six seven eight eight quartz and rich iron oh you know what this went up so i think i have a chicken for that and i might just have forgotten about it i'm gonna need eight of you do i have like this is a quartz chicken quartz and rich yes i did haha <laughs> okay so i did the right thing let's put that in here now I need 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 blocks of redstone. So redstone. 12. Like so. Perfect. Then I'm going to need 1, 2, 3, 4 resource generator 2. Aha, I already have those. So 4. What else do I need? I need 4 crystal matrix. I have those. Now I need some crafter. I need 5 crafter. One, two, three, four, five, start, go. And let's come back to my end. I'm only at 14 and steel, so probably I'm getting some conflict right here. Oh, these are pressing, okay. I'm just waiting on that last little bit, and we should be good. Come on. And this is the fastest it can be with this capacitor. So definitely splitting up the recipe because this requires dark steel. So having dark steel being made in a different one means that the two recipe could be working concurrently, uh, which is why I'm going to want to start adding more of those. So and crystal 32. Great. And the five crafter is all I'm missing, I believe. Five crafter. Perfect. And I'm going to come right here. And I'm going to switch to the third recipe. I'm going to say, make this one. And shift to save it. And grab those four. And voila. So, those are annoying. So you put them down like this. And, well, I'm going to put them differently at some point. And they just work. You just need to wait. You see the process? It's very, very slow. So now, if I come here, Neutron Pile... Neutron nugget, neutronium ingot, those are all things that I need to wait for. So these neutron pile are the beginning. That's what we're waiting. We still haven't gotten a single one. So these neutron, these neutron pile, okay, are going to craft nine into a neutron nugget. And see, we're going to need a couple for here. And that's going to make, and we're going to need a lot of neutron nugget. And neutron nugget are crafted with nine and four neutron nugget around an iron ingot is going to make a neutronium ingot which we're also going to need some for the armors and oh what, what this one neutron neutronium compressor what do i need you know i don't need a neutronium compressor oh thank thank you thank you okay so let's grab the neutronium pile but right now as you can see i cannot make the next one 
because I only have four. So ideally, you would want at least nine because if you have nine, I think this takes two minutes or something like that. If you have nine, does it say? Uh, no, it doesn't seem, it doesn't have the information. So uh, then if you get nine, then you can at least craft a nugget every time these nine produce because I've put them down at the same time. So they're all going to be producing about the same time. And with these nine, we'll be able to make the next the, the nuggets. But once we get nine, uh, four nuggets, we'll be able to make an ingot. And then we're going to be in the age of neutrons. So we're going to need a quantum compressor. And the quantum compressor is going to be used to make singularities. Yeah, but if you look at the singularities, they're not so bad. So next episode, um, no, sorry, not next episode. So I'm next episode, yes. Center, one second, calm down. Next episode is going to be a time lapse episode because this one is too long already and I need a crazy amount of neutron collector. Okay, so I'm next episode is going to be a big time lapse where I'm going to set one of each of these. I'm going to set one of these for this recipe, one of these for this recipe, and one of these for that recipe. Okay, and then I'm going to make sure that it's fully automatable. And then I'm going to start working on more chicken and more seeds. Like, you are annoying. Uh, what are you doing? I think this thing is just dead. It is dead. I just need to push it out. Come on. Oh, that's not the pneumatic wrench. <laughs> Just give me a second. Pneumatic wrench is this one. So now I can do this. And yeah. So what happened is that I forgot my armor in here. And when I forgot my armor in here, it completely discharged. And then it couldn't get in here anymore. This. And this. And this. this and while we're here let's do this and this and let's grab the chiller oh i have so much plastic see the thing is i don't even think i need plastic anymore i think i'm making way too much plastic for no reason so i'm going to have to address that at some point um, from here that down right here up from here and fill that again perfect so let me come back here are you charged so you're slowly charging and while we're waiting i'm going to need to make those drones better i think because this is like so important that i get all of this fully working because i need my chickens to always be producing and one of the things that i'm going to be doing in my time lapse is going to be making my chicken uh i'm going to be duplicating some chickens there are some chickens that i'm going to want a lot more of um great so not this one but like this one i'm probably going to want two or three quarts enriched iron chicken because i'm going to need a lot like this one i don't here at all the obsidian is also one that i'm going to cut want a couple of the string i don't care all that much feed you great uh these all need seeds so also this all needs to be moved downstairs so i'm at the point where i need to do a lot of little work left and right whoa You just take care. Oh, I hope you're not dangerous. Oof, okay, it wasn't a dangerous one. Sometimes these uh, magic one can be very dangerous. Can I grab you and you and you and you? Oh, that's great. And I'm about to get another one. So let's grab this next one from each of them. I don't think it's going to be enough to craft everything that I want. But if I take these nuggets 
So I'm, I'm going to need 9, 10, 11, 12 more to be able to now make a neutronium ingot. And 12 more is going to be a bit too long. So I don't think I'm going to wait for it. But you have the plan for the next episode. Like the next episode is going to be a time lapse. So in the next episode, we're also going to make our neutronium nugget. Whew. Wow, this was a lot of work. So let's put these down here because these are the things that we've done today. And I'm going to now go into the next episode directly with no time lapse because the next episode is going to be everything that we need to do to start like just bang out as many neutronium collector as possible because we're going to need a massive amount of those. Guys, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next episode. Bye now.